When Optimus first appeared on stage back in 2022, most people assumed it would take Tesla years, maybe even decades, to catch up to the bold promises Elon Musk made that night. But with the latest updates, that timeline just collapsed. Optimus didn't just improve, it jumped to an entirely new class of robotics. In just a few days, Tesla pushed the robot from steady walking to full speed running, and from simple hand movements to human grade dexterity. Engineers, investors, and even rival robotics teams are scrambling for answers, because no one expected a leap this big, this fast. And yet, Tesla insists this is only the beginning. But here's where things get even more intense. What Tesla revealed in this second update wasn't just another progress clip. This was a direct signal that Optimus is entering a completely new phase. For the past two years, every Optimus milestone has followed a predictable pattern. Improvements in walking, balance, dexterity, and basic autonomous tasks. But this time, Tesla didn't just show better movement, they showed capability. Real, functional capability that looks dangerously close to early commercial deployment. Optimus wasn't just moving boxes or flexing its hands. It demonstrated coordinated actions, object manipulation with precision, smoother-than-ever stability, and what appears to be a dramatic leap in its real-time decision-making. And the speed of iteration is what shocked everyone. If Tesla can deliver two milestones in 24 hours, what happens next week? Next month? Suddenly, the idea of Optimus entering factories, warehouses, and maybe even homes no longer feels like science fiction, it feels like a countdown. And while running and basic movement grab headlines, the real game changer is what Tesla did with Optimus hands. At the Neurops 2025 conference, the new generation of the Optimus hand was revealed, and it's unlike anything seen in commercial robotics. 22 degrees of freedom in the fingers, three more in the wrist and forearm. Tesla nearly matches the complexity of a real human hand. That means Optimus can handle tiny, delicate tasks, folding clothes, picking up fragile objects, assembling components, even playing musical instruments with surprising precision. This isn't just flashy tech, it's functional mastery. While most humanoid robots struggle with basic object interaction, Optimus hands allow it to operate in the real world exactly as a human would. A robot that can run but can't pick up a glass or turn a doorknob is limited. Tesla solved that problem. And combined with full body coordination, this hand upgrade instantly multiplies what Optimus can do. Factories, hospitals, even home environments could soon see robots performing tasks that previously required human hands. But hands alone don't make a robot useful, brains do. And Tesla's secret advantage lies in its end-to-end -end AI. Optimus isn't just executing pre-programmed moves. It understands space, objects, and context the way humans do. Thanks to billions of miles of data collected from Tesla vehicles, the robot's AI has a real-world model of how environments work. It can anticipate obstacles, predict object motion, and adjust its actions in real time. This combination of full-body coordination and deep environmental understanding is unprecedented. Most humanoid robots still rely on controlled labs, simplified tools, or structured setups. Optimus doesn't. It adapts to human environments as they exist, not as engineers design them to be. That's why Tesla can finally claim this isn't just a prototype. It's the first humanoid robot approaching real-world deployment, capable of performing meaningful tasks without the world needing to change around it. Of course, even the most advanced robot is useless if it can't be produced at scale. And this is where Tesla's real edge becomes impossible to ignore. While competitors struggle to move beyond flashy prototypes, Tesla has spent over a decade mastering the exact components and processes that allow mass production. Every Tesla electric vehicle is essentially a robot on wheels, and the lessons learned there, high-density batteries, custom actuators, precision drive units, AI-driven vision systems, and optimized production lines, translate directly to humanoid robotics. The Gen 3 Optimus isn't just an experimental model. It's the first version designed from the ground up for commercial deployment. Tesla plans to manufacture it at a price point that shocks the industry roughly $20,000 per unit. To put that in perspective, that's the cost of a large displacement motorcycle in the U.S. Yet this machine can run, lift, grasp, and operate autonomously. 
And thanks to Tesla's proven assembly lines, scaling from prototype to full production doesn't involve decades of trial and error. Factories in 2026 will begin producing Optimus at scale, with automation integrated into every stage. Tesla isn't relying on human labor to build these robots. The same robots and machines perfected for EV production will assemble their humanoid counterparts. That means a unit that costs $20,000 to produce today could be even cheaper tomorrow as processes optimize and components improve. Beyond cost, mass production unlocks something far bigger, real-world impact. Once thousands of units are circulating, Optimus can start integrating into factories, warehouses, hospitals, and even households. The bottleneck that has historically limited robotics, scarcity, slow iteration, and prohibitive cost is gone. And this is why Elon Musk can confidently make the boldest claims about the future. Not just because Optimus is capable, but because it's practical, affordable, and scalable. If Tesla succeeds, Gen 3 won't just be a demonstration model. It will be the first humanoid robot millions of people can interact with, employ, or even own. The combination of cost efficiency, AI intelligence, and full body dexterity transforms Optimus from a futuristic concept into a viable, everyday tool. In other words, Tesla isn't just making robots. They're creating a platform that could reshape how we work, live, and even think about productivity. But producing millions of Optimus units is only part of the story. The bigger, far more controversial question is, what happens when robots take over work humans once relied on for survival? Elon Musk hasn't shied away from answering that. He predicts that within the next 10 to 20 years, traditional jobs will become optional. Not because humans will stop working out of choice alone, but because humanoid robots will be capable of performing essential tasks faster, safer, and more efficiently than any human could. Imagine a world where logistics, retail, food service, and even healthcare support operate almost entirely on robots. Delivery robots could carry packages across cities, humanoid assistants could handle household chores, and service robots could staff restaurants and hospitals, all without fatigue, errors, or the need for breaks. Musk calls it a surplus economy, where basic necessities are abundant and work becomes a hobby rather than a requirement for survival, much like growing your own vegetables today. This idea sounds like science fiction, but with Tesla's combination of advanced AI, precise hardware, and mass production, it edges closer to reality. Optimus isn't a futuristic prototype. It's a working model of what Musk believes could fundamentally change human society. And the implications are staggering. On one hand, we could live in a world free from poverty, where robots handle laborious tasks and humans pursue creativity, research, and personal fulfillment. On the other hand, the sudden displacement of traditional jobs could create economic shocks if society doesn't adapt quickly enough. Tesla's strategy isn't just about creating a smarter robot. It's about shaping the foundation of a post-work economy. With millions of robots performing essential functions, the cost of goods and services could plummet, accessibility could skyrocket, and human priorities could shift from survival to innovation. But this vision also forces us to confront ethical, social, and political questions. How do we value human work? What role does purpose play in a life where machines handle most practical tasks? And are we prepared for the speed at which these changes could arrive? Musk's statements may sound bold, even unsettling, but they're backed by a decade of Tesla engineering and data-driven AI. Optimus is not just a robot. It's a test case for a world where humans no longer need to work to survive. And as these humanoid robots become smarter, faster, and more efficient, that test case could become the standard within a single generation. Then comes a claim that takes Tesla's ambitions into entirely uncharted territory, the Vonneman concept. Elon Musk envisions a future where Optimus robots could essentially replicate themselves. One robot could build another robot, which in turn could build more creating an exponential chain of production. Imagine factories operating almost entirely autonomously, where human oversight is minimal and production resources become effectively limitless. It's a concept that sounds like science fiction, but with Tesla's mass production expertise and AI systems, Musk argues it's entirely feasible. The implications are staggering. Not only could industrial output multiply hundreds of times over, 
but humans could finally step out of repetitive labor roles entirely. Factories, logistics centers, and construction sites could run continuously, 24-7, without the constraints of fatigue, safety risks, or labor shortages. Productivity wouldn't just increase. It could become practically infinite, limited only by material availability and human imagination. Musk doesn't stop there. He's even proposed sending these robots into space. Self-replicating humanoids could mine asteroids, build orbital stations, and prepare the surface of Mars long before humans arrive. In this scenario, Optimus is no longer just a labor-saving tool on Earth. It becomes humanity's first autonomous workforce for interplanetary expansion. Each robot could act as both a worker and a builder, constructing infrastructure that would be too dangerous, expensive, or slow for humans alone. And the timing matters. While other robotics companies are still testing small-scale prototypes in controlled labs, Tesla's approach, combining AI, mass production, and real-world adaptability, positions it as the first company capable of scaling humanoid robots globally and eventually off-planet. Musk is essentially proposing a future where humanity no longer faces limits in production, labor, or exploration. Optimus could turn ambitious visions into reality, a world of abundance, a workforce of robots, and even a multi-planet civilization built without relying on human labor for the most dangerous tasks. It's a future both thrilling and unsettling, because it forces us to rethink everything we thought we knew about work, value, and human purpose. And yet, for Elon Musk, this isn't speculation. It's the roadmap for the next decade of Tesla robotics. All of Tesla's breakthroughs, running, dexterous hands, end-to-end -end AI, mass production, and even self-replication, culminate in the Optimus Gen 3. This isn't a robot designed just to impress engineers or go viral on social media. It's a humanoid capable of performing thousands of real-world tasks that humans do every day. From cooking and cleaning to caregiving, hospital assistance, and factory work, Gen 3 has been engineered for practical, everyday use. Unlike most robots today, which require simplified environments, oversized tools, or structured setups, Optimus can handle objects designed exclusively for human hands. It can pick up a glass, twist a doorknob, fold laundry, or carry packages with precision. Tesla's philosophy is clear. Usefulness trumps showmanship. A robot that looks human but fails at real work is meaningless. Optimus Gen 3 doesn't just look impressive. It works reliably, continuously, and safely in real human environments. Elon Musk has said it could eventually be five times more productive than a human worker, able to operate 24-7 without fatigue. It could serve as a personal assistant, helping the elderly, supporting households, or even functioning in hospitals and restaurants. And because it's mass-produced and affordable, it's no longer just a futuristic dream. It's a tangible tool that could arrive in millions of homes and workplaces in the next few years. So what do we take from all of this? Optimus Gen 3 proves that humanoid robots are no longer a curiosity. They are becoming practical, capable, and scalable. The real question isn't whether they look human. It's whether they can perform real human tasks better, faster, and more reliably than we can. Tesla is redefining the boundaries of robotics, AI, and productivity. Running robots, dexterous hands, end-to-end -end AI, mass production, and even self-replication all point to one future. A world where work becomes optional, abundance is possible, and humans can focus on creativity, innovation, and life beyond survival. Now it's up to us to ask, are we ready for a world where robots like Optimus are not just helpers, but partners in every aspect of daily life?